Testing, one, two, three. Fire out, this is your dad. Just got home from work a little while ago. Uh, Frank come over to help us uh, fix this tape up for you. I want to wish you a happy birthday. I can still see you and uh, John standing out along the turnpike there last February waiting on those fellows that Mercury take you to Norfolk. I had a lot of things I wanted to tell you, but now that I'm uh, a recording artist, I, uh, I, don't, I don't know what exactly what to say. Your mother, uh, when I come home from work, your mother play, played the uh, recording uh, for what they had recorded already. And I heard the kids singing happy birthday to you and uh, your mother talking to you. Scott and your mothers, uh, they think they're uh, radio engineers or something here. Uh, oh, Frank, Frank went home now to eat some eggs and uh, the kids are upstairs giggling. Jim and Dick, I think the girls are sleeping though. Yeah, we're figuring on coming down uh, on the train. Uh, at least uh, that's what we're uh, figuring on now. But with this steel strike, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if, uh, what job I'll be working. Uh, I might even be on the extra list by that time. I don't think I'll be furloughed, but uh, it just depends how long it lasts. They were talking about cutting uh, a good many jobs off. We'll try to make it. I applied for a pass as yesterday, and uh, we're going to go by B and O from Pittsburgh to Washington, and then. Uh, down to Petersburg and uh, in Norfolk and Western over to Norfolk. Your mother wants to stay in the same hotel uh, that they stayed in last summer. She uh, likes to get down there in time to watch the fleet come in. We won't get there till midnight. And she's afraid we have to get up uh, at five o'clock. But I told her if the fleet was due in at seven, I, uh, she, uh, we could sleep till ten and still see it. Especially if, uh, especially if you don't get in any quicker than you did last uh, year in New York or even uh, when you came from Europe uh, there to Norfolk. Now, I guess I'm back on the air again here. I'll uh, sing you a little song. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ralph. Happy birthday to you. We uh, mailed you some cookies uh, the other day, the day before yesterday. Your mother was going to send a cake, but uh, as she told you before, uh, she was afraid it would uh, be all smashed up and all you'd be able to eat would be the crumbs. And uh, these cookies, she has them in a, has them in a uh, tin box. So they, uh, well, she told you you could dunk them in uh, some of that coffee there. That uh, coffee you uh, yeah, wash your socks in. How's John doing? Uh, well, uh, we read in your letter where you're going to take a test for uh, third class petty officer. I did tell you about Scott uh, marching up there at uh, Neville Island. He said they he said they were uh, all out of step with him. But I guess he'll catch on some of these days. He uh, was going down. Was going to a party down here. Uh, someone's house this evening, but uh, he wanted to know if he could stay out till 11.30, but now I see he's home, so uh, maybe they cleared him out. I don't know what, uh, what else to say. The old Plymouth's still running. One headlight. Scott says it's running, barely running, but it's not doing too bad. Needs a little work done on it.